Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Aries the Emperor here. I am back with another general reading for all of my Aries angels. If you are new here, welcome. Join us, stay for a spell. This is an all Aries channel for all of my Aries placements. Cross watchers, you are always welcome. Just take in mind that this reading may or may not resonate with everyone and that is okay. Do not force the reading. Place the gender roles where they need to apply for you. This is energy. Energy is all fluid. So I'm super excited um, to be here with all of you guys for all of you to be coming with me going forward into the 2024 year. Um, and I'm just as thankful for you guys as I am for bringing you with me. Um, I'm super thankful that you guys are bringing me with you as well here. So my gratitude from the bottom of my heart, you guys. Thank you to everybody who likes and subscribes to the channel for your donations. To those of you who share my readings, book personal readings, and shop the website. I have begun my break it's the 31st, so the website is still open. I will not be sending out any personal readings until the second half of January. So you're more than welcome to place your orders, okay? Candle orders, oils, and soaps will go out per usual. There will not be um, delay in that. I am working still behind the scenes to get your orders out as well. Just personal readings, but I'm going to make an exception. The only readings that I will accept on the website before the second half are emergency readings, and those are listed on the website. So if it's not an emergency reading, then I will not get to it until the latter part of January. Okay. But if you need to connect with me, all of my information is down in the description box down below, as well as my channel number two that I revamped. Thank you to all of you who go over and support as well. There are messages in there for you, just like in this, um, in the Aries channel. Um, so don't discriminate. We all are made up of the entire Zodiac. So don't cheat yourself, baby. Treat yourself is what I'm going to say. Kiss my Cosmo is the name of my second channel and it's in the link as well down below okay i've been getting questions about that all right let's jump into it you read the title let's see what messages come out today's date is 12 31 23 spill that out one two three one two three is what today's date reads out so i feel like that is a clear sign you know you fuck this up going forward you're gonna be repeating cycles sequences synchronicities all right so some y'all take heed as a warning here and i feel like you are putting your best foot forward, but at the same time, somebody that did not, you know what I'm saying? Whatever obstacle, you know, whatever adversity, whatever evil spirit tried to conjure up and, and send evil eye in your direction, you know, I feel like they are going to repeat the very same thing that they put out on you here. Ah, the tower first card out and that's destruction. Everybody don't know what they doing when you're in the kitchen cooking, you know, and, and like they say, too many chefs in the kitchen can fuck up a whole recipe. See, you are like that family recipe that you can only get from like your grandmama or your great, great grandmama, or it's only passed down to, to certain people in the family because they know when, when they put your hands on it, you're going to get it right. This is what is being passed down to you from spirit. And it's your energy, the tower. You know, next to the emperor, this is like one of the most powerful, if not the most powerful energies out here. And this is the, the pasta tarot deck that we're using. You know what I mean? So not only that, you know, pasta is something that's hard to get. It's hard to make. 
It's a, an Italian delicacy that I'm grateful for. <laughs> you know what I mean here? So now this is an energy of, of spirit. And this is the leaning tower of Pisa. Talk about a landmark. A historical staple. Generational lineage, prestige is the energy that I'm getting here. You know, somebody may have thought, and I want to say this right, that you are old, outdated, or because what your traditions are, are not that of People feeling like, because just think about it, you know, people go to see all of these old monuments and all of these old um, landmarks and, and just different parts of the world that aren't visited anymore. You know, you are being pulled from that energy or you, you, you are cut from that block here. You know, it may be old, but it is going to stand the test of time. And I'm not calling anybody old. I just want you to know how important you are and what you are doing and what you are put here. You are meant to stand the test of time, no matter what storm comes out of nowhere, no matter what karma, no matter what circumstances, no matter what evil, you know, it, it will not prosper here. You come from the lightning. You come from the light. You come from the spark. So this is somebody playing on a, a playing field that they have no business embarking on or even have an opinion on having or even having the nerve to get comfortable in. You know what I mean here? Because once spirit gets a whiff, then that's it. You know, somebody's going to pay for new and old. Somebody's in debt to not the devil, but to spirit. You know, it's one thing to be in debt to the devil, but when you in debt to the to spirit, the spirit gods, oh, they got the power to make this person's life a living hell. Cycle after cycle. And I feel like this is your power coming through. This is your fury of the ancestors. Y'all not going to believe what just came out. The Ten of Lunga. A.K.A. the Ten of Swords. You see what's happening in this card? There's wine spilling on this man's head. Hell, the whole pasta ball. <laughs> is this not somebody paying? How ironic is that? The waiter who is a professional at bringing stuff out. You know, I know accidents happen in the restaurant industry. I've worked in the restaurant industry as well as a waitress. Um, and I know how hard it is having to fill up that entire, you know, tray here and bring it to the table. But come on, man. Everything. <laughs> Somebody is about to reap what they sow tenfold and it's not good. You know, this is you... This is your tower, you know, and it's been filled up with all this unnecessary energy, all these unnecessary projections and so forth. But now you're about to get closure on this. Someone who tried to come in and ruin you, tried to ruin the tower. Just imagine if you owned a business and you had the best pasta or, you know, you take care of yourself. You're the nicest person out there. People love coming to you. They love taking you out. They love being in your energy. They love inviting you out. And you got somebody trying to ruin your entire existence here. They're going to need to be left here in 2020, 2023. Because we have the five of quarter, a.k.a. the five of wands. Somebody thought this was a game playing with you. And they realize just how much of a pawn that they really are in this game. 
They they bet they chips out too fast. Hmm. Asa Manuta, aka Ace of Pentacles. You. You have been coming out as the Ace of Pentacles in the last few readings. And these are different decks that I am using. I think you came out in the last reading as the Ace of Pentacles. It's like that saying, you know, oh, they come from old money. New money, money is money. You know what I'm saying? But that old money... That's that money that stands the test of time. That's you. You know what I mean? And, and it don't have to literally be money. But I'm just saying how valuable you are and what you come from. And that's the divine. It's something that's stable. It's, it's something that don't fall off. It don't get weak. It don't go low. It don't get short. And now somebody's figuring that out. Huh. And now not only are they figuring it out, they see that there's karma following them, literally. Because guess what? Spirit going to bet on you every time. And now whoever this is, they're about to find this out so quickly, so swiftly. The lovers, just how loved that you really are in this realm and in that realm far out there where this angel is peaking, veering and continuing to push that love out there for you. Whether this is in yourself or whether this is the, the people that's supposed to fall off, falling off and those who are supposed to be there with you, your closest, your surroundings are Hovering closer around you. Ten of Minuta, a.k.a. the Ten of Pentacles. Family, friends, relatives. Same thing as family, but I also feel like, you know, this is an energy of them too trying to betray you. Or, you know, people will have a thing about trying to compete with you. As far as your car, your clothes, your job, your this, your that, whole time you're not even at the poker table. So the joke's on them. They spending out all their money and all their energy and all their time and you're not even looking in their direction. Confirmation. It's like that. Anything you can do, I can do better. I can do anything better than you. And you're showing them. And spirit going to make sure that they get it. Four of Lunga, a.k.a. the Four of Swords. You know, somebody just ruined all of their good karma. Somebody spoke too soon. They moved too soon. They judged you too soon. And this could be somebody that feels a way about your sexuality or, or as far as what you like and what you don't like. It's none of their business. You do you, you live you. Is what spirit is telling you here going forward. This is also a structure of, yeah, they think they can come in and ruin you and tear whatever you got going on, tear it down. But watch spirit come back and build it even bigger. And just like this leaning tower, it's been here for, for centuries. That's your energy. You're not going nowhere. Six of Lunga, a.k.a. Six of Swords. 
you're not going anywhere but forward. More adventures. Seven of Minuta, seven of Pentacles. You're just getting started. And Spirit going to give you another shot over and over and over and over again until you get it right. Did I not just tell you what the date was? One, two, three, one, two, three. And the seven of Pentacles is an energy of, yeah, maybe I didn't get it right the first time, but let's go back and see what we could change and restructure here. You are someone who is being granted the permission to take your time. This ain't no race for you. The sooner you realize that, the sooner a lot of y'all are going to move forward and win a lot faster. But just take what you have going on serious at this time. Be grateful for what spirit has done for you in your life. And have faith and trust. You know, because... Uh, you got enough people out here betting against you. You know what I'm saying? And let them do what they do. And you continue to do what you do here because spirit is keeping mental note here and is circling the block one by one to take care of your dirty work. Not to say your dirty work, but more like like the garbage man. You, you, you pull your trash to the end of the block at the end of... Um, or the beginning of the morning and, 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 and spirit is going to be the, the garbage truck that comes through and, and goes ahead and dumps it out for you. Ace of Repenia, Ace of Cups. So you can refill, recharge, you know, go in there and, and cook some more and, and recreate whatever it is that you need to put back out there. So the next time you need to clear out a cycle, um, spirit is going to be there to do that for you here. And anybody else that has something to say against that or come up against that will be dealt with. I'm going to leave this reading here. <laughs> Hit that like and subscribe button for more messages from me. I'll catch you later. Ciao.